SNC Entertainment recently released a special collaboration webtoon as part of the promotions of SF9's mini-album, Sensuous. The first episode, which was released on July 24, has been receiving much criticism for degrading SF9 as they were portrayed as a failed idol group. When FNC Entertainment was in a meeting with an American agency, the webtoon pointed out SF9's unimpressive sales figures and referred to them as untalented, obscure idols. Moreover, the members in the webtoon were training while doing part-time jobs at the troll station. Fans were not impressed with how SF9 was portrayed in the webtoon and could not understand the intentions of the webtoon. Ad choice as advertising in red invented by Teeds. What are they trying to do? What is the purpose of making this webtoon? They not only compare the album sales to other successful idols in the agency, how could a 20-year-old write lyrics like that? This is not about disrespect towards an artist, it's disrespectful as a person. How do they usually treat the artists for this kind of content is posted without any consideration, the members will probably see this webtoon too. They completely degraded the group let alone support them. Did the members not work hard? They do everything they're told and while the company makes them do promotions without even regard to their health. The content of the webtoon is just ridiculous. You made it seem like the group was such a failure that it's a miracle that they're making a new album lol. Fans are apparently more even disappointed because of the fact that the creator of the webtoon, Hi and Madame, is an acquaintance of Rowan as the two met on the program Sunderbang. As a result, FNC Entertainment posted an official apology for the content that has offended many fans. Despite the apology, fans continue to express their disapproval of the webtoon and demand that it be deleted. Is it a hobby of your agency to post apologies that don't even sound like apologies? Are you trying to put the issue to sleep with that insincere apology? You're not going to delete the posted webtoon. You should have known better than to produce such content when you're well aware of how hard our members work. Tilda thanks a lot for the short explanation Tilda, so why aren't you deleting the webtoon? Deleting that webtoon isn't going to affect their comeback and it's only right to remove it if it's causing a problem. You are seriously so ignorant, so are you going to continue posting the webtoon? Young Hae and renews his contract with FNC Entertainment.